the royal family not showing up for the Women's World Cup final in Australia on Sunday is not a good look, according to a royal expert. And the firm's argument that it's a long way to go for a couple of hours is not particularly strong, Daily Express royal correspondent Richard Palmer said on the Royal Roundup podcast with Pandora Forsyth on Friday. He said, they could have thought about this in advance, they could have built in a potential program if they wanted. It didn't even have to be England, it could have been Australia in that final. It's also what some of the Australians are saying, they feel let down that the royal family haven't gone out there. There has been a lot of criticism lately over the royal family choosing not to attend this year's FIFA Women's World Cup final on Sunday, despite normally taking the month of August off royal duties. Prince William's new role wouldn't have gone down well with Prince Harry. Prince William may be president of the English Football Association (FA), but it was announced he will not visit Australia and he and his family are enjoying a long summer holiday. William and Kate haven't been to Australia since 2014, it's a long long time now, the expert said. According to a poll for the Express on whether Prince William should attend the World Cup final to cheer on the Lionesses, 57% voted yes, 40% voted no and a 3% voted don't know. Richard stressed there have been deeper concerns about why the king has not visited any Commonwealth countries since ascending to the throne. He added royals not attending the final is evidence there has been a bit of a drift in the monarchy and Terry's a strong need to refocus the expert said, he added, it's also evidence I think of what some people have said is a bit of drift in the monarchy at the moment. It has been suggested that the king got off to a very good start in the new reign, but Terry's been a bit of drift lately. I think Terry's a need to refocus. Why haven't they been to all these Commonwealth realms? You would expect the new king to go out and visit these realms, and I'm sure part of the equation is that in several of the countries. Some of the Prime Ministers of these countries are Republicans, 